on an easy test that could help to determine your risk. That's on tonight's health Well, most people know that you can help control your risk for heart disease through diet and exercise and by not smoking. But an affordable screening test might make you take your risk factors a little more seriously. It's called the Calcium Score Screening Heart Scan, and it helps identify plaque buildup in your arteries. Tonight, we take you through the test with Simi River Health System, where I recently had the test in Ocean Springs. Going up, this is your right coronary artery. Cardiologist Dr. Mahmoud Zayed is looking at images taken with a CT scanner of the coronary arteries. These are actually my images. I decided to have the test because it's recommended for women over 50 and men over 45, especially if you have risk factors for heart disease, which Dr. Zayed says Mississippians are more likely to have. High heart disease rate, high obesity rate, high diabetes rate, all these lead to clustering of risk factors. And anyone in that age group who has lived in Mississippi for that long has a very good chance of having at least two risk factors for heart problems. The test only takes a few minutes. Dr. Zayed says it uses low-dose radiation to check for calcium deposits found in plaque in the coronary arteries, a condition that can lead to dangerous blockages. This is a screening test for patients that don't have any symptoms of heart disease who basically want to know if they do have or don't have any plaque buildup. It's a very inexpensive way, an accurate way, of finding out if you do have disease. It's never easy to put yourself through screening tests because you could discover you have a health problem you don't even know about. But Dr. Zayed says that's also why it's important because the earlier it is detected, the better off you will be. These are images of a patient with calcium in the arteries. It's very dense white calcium. Whenever you have calcium, that means there is plaque. But if you don't have any calcium, that doesn't mean you don't have early plaque. If calcium is found, Dr. Zayed says it often helps convince people that they do have a problem and they're more likely to follow through with changes that may help prevent further damage. Diet, exercise, smoking cessation, and basically taking medicines that have proven benefit with reducing the risk of future cardiovascular events like the statins, like the ACE inhibitors and the beta blockers. Fortunately for me, the results were good. There's no calcium here. Your calcium score is zero, which puts you at a very low risk category. That's good news, then. Excellent. The Excellent. good results offer a peace of mind and indicate that my risk of having a blockage, at least for the next few years, is low. And it is important to remember that while this test is a helpful tool, it is not absolute in predicting your risk for a life-threatening heart event. By the way, we kept talking about how affordable it is. It is $100, and it must be ordered by your physician. Jeff and Rebecca.